One of these was shot by a Hollywood film crew and the other was made entirely by AI. Can you tell which is which? Don't scroll because what you're about to see changes filmmaking forever. The left was Hollywood and the right was a revolutionary new AI model called Sora 2 and I'm willing to bet you couldn't tell which was which. Earlier this year, tools like Runway Gen 3 and Google's VO2 blew people's minds. They could generate short cinematic clips that looked impossible just a year ago. Everyone thought that was the future. But then Sora 2 launched and it's already changing the way video production is done. Sora 2 isn't just another AI video generator. It's the clearest look at how artificial intelligence might reshape filmmaking itself. So today we're tackling three big questions. One, will tools like Sora 2 replace video editors? Two, what actually makes Sora 2 different from everything that came before it? And last, what happens next for creators and the entire film industry? Let's start with the big one everyone's wondering about. When you watch Sora 2 clips, the realism is wild. The lighting, the motion, the depth, it doesn't just fake detail, it actually understands it. And that's what freaks a lot of people out. Because if AI can produce shots that look this good, what happens to everyone who used to film or edit them? Well, here's the truth. AI tools like Sora aren't replacing editors. They're replacing tasks, the boring repetitive stuff that eats up hours. That work can now be done in minutes. Even big productions are using AI behind the scenes. In Everything Everywhere All at Once, AI-powered rotoscoping helped clean scenes that once took weeks. But storytelling has never been about just cutting clips together. It's about emotion, pacing, and meaning. AI can generate a shot, but it can't decide why that shot matters. So no, this isn't the end of human editors. It's the start of a new kind of editor, one who uses AI AI as creative leverage, not competition. It's kind of like how the writers who are still successful today leverage tools like ChatGPT to assist them. And that leads to the next question. What exactly makes Sora 2 so different from all the other tools we've seen before? Over the past year, we've seen tools like Runway Gen 3 and Google VO2 dominate the headlines. They've produced incredible results, fast cinematic short clips that almost look real, but they still had limits. Sora 2 builds on those foundations and goes further. It doesn't just render a frame, it predicts physics. Netflix recently revealed its first AI generated VFX scene, a full building collapse completed 10 times faster and for a fraction of the cost. That's how real this shift already is. If Runway Gen 3 felt like shooting on your phone, Sora 2 feels like shooting on an IMAX camera. Both can tell a story, but one pulls you completely inside. So if this is where AI video tools already are, the real question left is, how much crazier does it get from here? Two years ago, AI video looked like a joke. Remember that Will Smith eating spaghetti clip? It looked like a nightmare. The kind that still haunts your dreams. Now that same concept created in Sora 2 looks like the real Will Smith. His skin, the lighting, the reflections, it all feels real. And actually come to think of it, Chris Rock could probably make a video of himself slapping Will this time. But seriously, in just two years, AI video has gone from meme to movie making. Hollywood's already experimenting with creative transitions powered by AI. In Here, starring Tom Hanks, AI generated surreal melting effects that blended time timeline seamlessly. So the question isn't whether AI will ever match human filmmaking. It's how creators will use it to push storytelling further because the most successful creators won't be the ones who resist AI. They'll be the ones who learn to direct it. What's exciting about this isn't just what Hollywood can do with Sora 2. It's that the same tools the biggest studios in the world are using are now accessible to people like you and me. If they're powerful enough for Netflix, they're more than enough for a solo creator creator or small business. Because these tools aren't about replacing talent, they're about giving you leverage. The right tools let one person do what used to take a team. They help you look a hundred times more professional, create at a higher level, and stay consistent without burning out. What used to take days editing, animating, or storyboarding can now be done in a single prompt. And that's the real story here. Not that AI is replacing creativity, but that it's democratizing it. So whether you're an editor, a filmmaker, or just someone with an idea, this is your moment because for the first time in history, the playing field is actually level. Every creative revolution starts with fear. When cameras appeared, 
painters thought art was over, but creativity didn't die, it evolved. Tools like Sora 2 are that next evolution, and the creators who learn how to use these tools intentionally to create faster, tell better stories, and look more polished than ever will define what comes next. Now, if you could turn any idea in your mind into a living, breathing video, what would you make first? Comment below. And if you found this video helpful, make sure you like and subscribe for content featuring the best tools that give you more leverage just like this. In fact, check out this AI powered tool that will automatically edit your videos in just two minutes. I'll see you in there.